Hi, this is Ricardo and welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. Today I'm going to show you a cool tip. Now this tip can only be performed on laptops. And basically what I'm going to show you though is to figure out the hidden password of any Wi-Fi. But there are a few conditions that must be in place before you can actually do it. And those conditions are, one, you need to have already connected to that um, Wi-Fi hotspot. And two, the, um, you had to actually have it in your history. So for example, let's say you're going to connect and this Wi-Fi I've already connected to and here it is it's called um, hotspot and let's say you did not know the password now basically if it was input into your computer already and it has already connected or once it's around or you can just do this you're gonna right click I'm gonna go on to properties and you can see over here on the security tab um, notice that it says that it's a Wi-Fi that's personal and it shows AES and it shows a network security key and just to figure out the key all you gotta do is just hit the show characters so the first thing I want you to do is just simply hit on show um, characters for the network key and here you go you just hit that and this would have been the Paris password for this particular Wi-Fi if you had connected to it and it will reveal the password so now you can actually connect other devices or connect to it without um, the person telling you the Wi-Fi. You can use this to recover passwords or to know the password of a Wi-Fi that you're connected to. Now, if you want to allow somebody to connect to your network, here's the cool thing that you should do. Now, if you want a person just to connect temporarily, I want you to just come like this. And then, of course, you're going to uncheck this option that says connect automatically. Alright? If it's a first-time person and you also want to give them um, temporary access, you're going to just hit connect. Um, and of course it will then ask for the password and then you put in the password by unchecking that option it will make sure as soon as the person disconnects that the information is erased from their computer however if you keep it checked it will keep the information in their computer and they can go back and actually look at the history and actually be able to retrieve the password if they know how. so my advice is that only do that for people that you have around the house permanently or people that you don't mind them knowing the password all right so okay guys this has been a quick tutorial showing you how to retrieve um, your password for connections that you have um, that you want to know the password in um, case this is a cool trick to know and do remember to keep these two tips in mind guys and please use it, these um, tips responsive. This is Ricardo from Block Tech Tips saying goodbye until next time. Bye.